Hi, my name is Shitaj Mahan, Technical Marketing Engineer with Cisco Systems. Today, I am going to demonstrate Hotspot 2.0 feature which is based on IEEE standard 802.11u. Cisco Wireless is already capable of providing Hotspot 2.0 services right since the code version 7.2 which was released back in 2012. With iOS 7 for newer iDevices and Samsung Galaxy S4, we are seeing more adaptations of Hotspot 2.0 feature on the client devices as well. Hotspot 2.0 with Passpoint certified client devices provides seamless authentication and handoff from cellular network to wireless network with providing automated network discovery, registration and provide provisioning. Before going into the demonstration, let's evaluate limitations of the previous generation of Hotspot services. In, in most common deployment, it was based on web-based authentication for user onboarding. Let's look at the key limitation of this process. Number one, connection simplicity. User has to select valid SSID, then open web browser to enter either credentials, credit card details, or to accept terms and conditions, which is not as seamless as roaming across different cellular networks. Number two, data encryption. Web authentication uses simple open network rather than using AES-based encryption, which is more common in enterprise networks. And number three, network security. End user has to manually select valid SSID simply based on its name without knowing its integrity. To address these issues, let's get into the test setup and demo of Hotspot 2.0. For the test setup, we have one Cisco 3700 dot 11 ac capable access point connected to cisco 5508 wireless lan controller running latest 7.6 code for eSIM authentication we will be using radius server which have all the client sim card information for web-based authentication user has to pull out his device from the pocket unlock it go to the settings menu and then select a proper SSIDs from bunch of broadcasting SSIDs simply based on trial and error. Then go to the web browser, enter credentials, for example, email address, and then finally get access to the internet. The connection is still open, it's not encrypted. On the right hand user device, that is iPhone and its SIM card, is equipped with Hotspot 2.0 services and they make the selection of valid Wi-Fi SSID, initiate handshake, verify credentials and get user onboarded. All this action is happening behind the scene. So whenever user pulls out his cell phone from the pocket, he is already connected on the secured internet access. So in conclusion, Hotspot 2.0 and Cisco Wireless offer seamless, secure and simple to use hotspot services for users without interaction and hassle. These services can be beneficial for end users since they will be getting free access to secure internet for cellular operators since they can offload expensive data traffic from cellular network to Wi-Fi network and even for a venue operator who can offer add-on services based on this hotspot services. Thank you for watching this video.